Hello everybody and welcome to the year end review where I'm going to tell you all the fucking shit I did this year. If if you remember anything about me the last few weeks besides my hair looking like that, um I've had um kind of a rough few weeks and I was feeling kind of down and sorry for myself. And then I decided I would start listing all of my accomplishments from this year and talk about it. So here we go. Put out 19 chapbooks this year. 19 chapbooks. One of those, obviously, was um, Bunny's Potato Manifesto. Um, and then I'm also counting those little mini zines that I did, the Chicken Strips and Madness in that as well. But that, that's a lot of stuff to put out. I put one paper back out this year so far. Should have been two, but I'm fucking lagging. And that is the uh, the Poetic Anarchy Volume 2 book. Put um, three ebooks out, um, which would be Dead Dame Curse, the Hank Bradshaw mystery, Alpha Hunter, the fourth book in the Zombie Zero series, and um, the re-release of... Uh, black market blood drive so that's cool I, I didn't count but i was pushing a hundred videos every month between members videos and what videos i put up on youtube and i know um, in the beginning of the year i wasn't posting that much so i, I didn't even count but a, a ridiculous amount um, I've gotten over 500 subs since last year's total, so that's cool. Um, nearly 20 members to the channel, and some of them had to step away for financial reasons, and I'm sure they'll fucking come back. But that's fucking amazing. I can't fucking believe it. Um, the blood rag started, and we're on issue 6 right now, and that's going fucking great. I put out two EPs of music this year, Um the first two parts of the Goodbye Hope series, so the Filthy Hamster Wheel Spins and the couple named Emotional Instability. And the only reason why I didn't put out the last two is because my guitar fucked up. Like, I have some... I have to take my guitar into the shop and have it worked on. And I really just don't want to do that. It's pissing me off. But anyway, so two releases, two music releases. Um, I made four short films this year. And I thought I had completely given up on filmmaking. So that was fucking awesome. Just, like, getting a taste for that again. Like, it, it, it felt so fucking good. And I was really digging the experimental shit I was doing. Um, and then I started Horrywood. And I put up the first five chapters of that. But the reason why I kind of slowed down on that is because I'm not digging Kindle Vela. I'm not digging the platform. So I think what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to pull it down and just start putting um, Horrywood on my website. I think that's the fucking plan. So fingers crossed. Um, beyond that, my sales um, have like... Compared to last year. So that's always fucking good to hear. Like everywhere my music's available. Like it's so fucking weird. Like how much shit you can do today. You know. Like I don't fucking do anything for my music. And I get money every month from it. And it's not like a huge amount of money. But it pays like the water bill. You know. Fuck. Like, why the fuck not, dude? I don't know. It's just... It's cool. And because, again, this is coming from three different musical projects. So, what are you going to do? Oh, and then my art. I painted over 50 fucking things. And last night, I got the bug again. And I painted six more things. I don't know if I should show them. Maybe I will. Let me go get them. I'm not going to show you all of them. Because one of them was kind of dirty. I fucking bring over the one that I just said I'm not going to show, and it was, like, in front. So, um, this is the stuff I painted. This. 
this dash this and this. Now some of you might be going, wow, that's just a bunch of shit on a fucking page, dude. Yeah, but that's kind of how it goes. Like, with me and painting, I usually have to paint um, three or four things before I start, like, getting the inspiration to start doing more things. And this one here, like, let me just walk you through this. Okay, so this one here, I started with this thing, like this, psh, psh, uh, wait, this way, and down here. And then I did this up here, and then I did this little psh, thing here. And then I did this really thick black bit right here. And I'm like, I don't like that. I don't like just like having a blocky straight line that's not me. I don't know what the fuck that is. So then I started just running the brush through it, and then the brush started looking like tire tracks. And um, I just kept going and going and going and going and going and going and then getting crazy and getting crazy. And that's how it happens, you know? And I really fucking like this one now. Like, I think this one's fucking great. I think I'm going to call it plaid or picnic blanket. I'm not sure. Something like that. This one... I took all the brushes out of my water thing that I like have my brushes in in between and I took them all out at once and I just went ah, 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 and made this awesome like gray circular background thing and then I tried to do like a really thin line with the black ink and then because it was so wet it started spreading and it, so I just did this little bit in the middle here. And then I was going to do more, and then I'm like, no, fuck it, I like it. Like, I'm just going to leave it. Know when to walk away. And this one, because I just did a really awesome, cool splatter, I'm like, oh, I'll just draw a face. And so that was that. Um, this one, this was me warming up. This was the first one I did. This is my warm-up one. Just getting used to the brushes and getting the ink and everything. And then this one, I'm not going to say what this is, but this was the one that I was like, like wanting to make. This is probably why I started painting this one right here. And I'm pissed off about it. And this one makes me angry. So if you don't know what it is, good. Because unlike with my poetry, sometimes I like to hide in my art. I just fucking go. I just make, you know? And a lot of times when things are fucking rough and I'm fucking down on shit, it's hard to focus on all those fucking amazing things that I've done. And it's also hard for me to sit here and say amazing things that I've done. That's hard to fucking say. But... As a fucking artist, as a writer, as a poet, we have to be able to know that our stuff is fucking worth a damn. We have to. Because if we don't, no one else will. You know what I'm saying? So no matter how hard it is, you got to fucking understand that that's what it is. Now, I know a lot of you who joined the Anarchy Crew this year have probably increased your productivity 100%. And I would love to hear about that. So leave it in the comments down below. And if you're not in the Anarchy Crew, let me know what you guys have done too. Like, leave it in the fucking comments. All of your accomplishments, leave them down below. Let's all celebrate each other and fucking end this year the right way with a big fucking bang. All right? Type hard, everybody. Keep buying my books. Keep buying my shit, wherever it is. And I will talk to you all later. I just want to give a quick thanks to those people who make these videos possible. Anarchy Crew and my followers on Patreon. I appreciate the hell out of you guys. And thank you so much for keeping me going to keep this content possible. You guys are awesome. And if you'd like to join the crew or the Anarchy Crew, just hit the join button beneath this video. And if you'd like to become a member of my Patreon, you can run over to the link down below to do that as well. Thank you.